Hi, I'm Jackie Jordan with Clemson Extension, and this is Gardening and Casey. So when you start gardening, sometimes you'll notice that problems come up. Unfortunately, there are lots of pests in the garden. And this year, we've had a lot of rain, so diseases are rampant. What are you supposed to do? Well, the first thing, take a good look at the plant. Now, you want to take an, an examine and try to identify what is actually going on. This is an oak tree, so these holes will probably indicate that caterpillars or another chewing pest have been on there. Where something like this hydrangea has spots on the leaves. This is Cercospora leaf spot, a fungal disease that commonly affects hydrangeas. Other leaf spots can look different with all different shapes and sizes. Some insect pests are piercing sucking insects and so when they pierce the leaf they suck the photosynthates out of the leaf and leave this kind of corrugated rough bumpy look kind of shrunken look um, so beginning to get an idea of what you're looking for can help you decide the course of treatment sometimes you've got nutrient deficiencies. So things like a deficiency in nitrogen can cause leaves to be pale, or some of the micronutrients like iron or even zinc. If you have any questions at all about what's going on in your garden, remember that the Clemson Extension is here to help you. HGIC, the Home and Garden Information Center, has a toll-free number and you can text pictures up to them as well. Uh, we also have a website with lots of fact sheets on all the different plants that you can grow in your garden. I'm Jackie and I'm here with Gardening and Casey and look forward to more videos from us.